you are familiar with the concept of tenses by now and you know that tense is about time. Verbs change depending on the time of action or state. So we have to look at a verb to understand its tense. You have learned about the present perfect continuous tense Today, we will learn a little bit more about this present perfect continuous tense. We know that the present perfect continuous tense shows that an action began in the past and is still in progress at the time of speaking. For example, he has been working on the computer for a long time. It also shows an action that began in the past and is continuing regularly up to the present. For example, I have been eating salads every evening. Now let us compare this tense with some other tenses to understand it better. If I say Mary is worried because her baby brother is crying. We can understand that this action is happening now at the present. When I say that Mary is worried because her baby brother has been crying for over two hours now, what do we understand? Let us try to understand the sentence with the help of a timeline. In the timeline, this is sometime now in the present. We know that her baby brother started crying two hours before. Two hours before started crying and since then for the entire two hours he kept on crying till now and now also he is still crying. So has been crying is showing us an action that started sometime in the past, continued for two hours and is still happening now. So the present continuous tense shows us an action in progress now whereas the present perfect continuous tense shows that an action started in the past continued for a duration of time what is the duration of time in this case two hours and is still in progress if i say i have worked in an ngo recently what does it mean? It means that I started working in an NGO some time back in the past, but I do not work there anymore because I have said recently. So how will I show it with the help of a timeline? This is now in the present. I started working in the NGO Sometime in the past, I don't know when, I continued working till sometime before. So I have stopped working recently. But the effect is still in the present. In the present perfect continuous tense, I will say, I have been working in an NGO for five years. How will we show this in a timeline? This is the timeline. This is now. In the present, I have started working sometime in the past. What is the past? What is the time in the past? Five years before. 
since then i have continued working in the ngo and i still do now so the present perfect tense is showing us that an action started in the past has been recently completed and has an impact in the present whereas the present perfect continuous tense shows us that an action started in the past continued for a duration of time what is the duration of time in this case 5 years and is still in progress that means i still work at the ngo now let us look at these two sentences i have studied english from a very early age i have been studying english from a very early age we know that have studied is in the present perfect tense so what does it mean it means that i have started studying english in the past at a very early age but i may have stopped it recently or i may have continued studying it so what do we mean by this by this we mean that i have started studying english in the past at a very early age but i may have stopped studying english or i may have continued it till now in this case i have been studying english it is in the present perfect continuous tense and it always means that an action started in the past so i started studying english at a very early age in the past i have continued studying english and i still study english so the present perfect tense tells us that an action started in the past and in this case it may or may not be in progress whereas the present perfect continuous tense always means that the action started in the past continued for a duration of time and is still in progress so may be in case of the present perfect tense and still in progress in case of the present perfect continuous tense essentially give us the same meaning so at times they convey the same meaning to us it depends how you use them in your sentence and what you are trying to say at times some verbs convey the same meaning in the present perfect tense as well as in the present perfect continuous tense as in this example they have stayed in new york since childhood it means that they started staying in new york in their childhood and they may or may not be staying in new york right now but when we say they have been staying in new york since childhood we mean that they started staying in new york in the past in their childhood they have continued staying in new york all the time and they are still staying in new york so in this case also the present perfect tense shows that an action started in the past may or may not be in progress whereas the present perfect continuous tense always shows us the action started in the past continued for a duration of time and is still in progress so since there is a maybe in case of the present perfect tense and still in progress in case of the present perfect continuous tense they essentially give us the same meaning in both the cases so verbs like studied stayed mean the same in some cases it depends how you use them in the sentences let us now fill in the blank with appropriate present perfect continuous form i 
dash on this report since morning. Since is telling us the time that this action has started. What are the options to us? Am working, have working, have been working. Which verb form tells us that an action started in the past, continued for a duration of time and is still in progress? Does am working convey that? No. Does have working convey that? No. Have been working conveys that and follows the verb form which is have plus been plus the ing form of the verb. So the correct answer is I have been working. on this report since morning. I hope now your concepts of the present perfect continuous tense are much clearer and you can clearly differentiate between the present perfect tense, the continuous tense and the present perfect continuous tense. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. You can also register for free at deltastep.com or download the Delta Step app to get all learning resources as per ICSC, CBSC, IB, Cambridge or any other curriculum. Over 5000 amazing lectures across Maths, Science, English and Social Science. Our unique interactive video technology keeps you engaged and our iDictionary feature allows you to quickly revise any concept. Master each topic at your own pace with our adaptive practice technology and 1 million plus questions. Get instant answers and detailed solutions. Be exam ready by taking unlimited mock tests, performance analysis with actionable feedback, personal tutors to resolve your slightest of doubts. That's not all. You can also win amazing prizes like PlayStation, iPad, watches and many more along with certificates through our Earn As You Learn program. So learning at Delta Step is not just fun and easy, it is also rewarding. So register for free now.